We've had an overview of the dip, but let's take a look at some of these sections in more detail. Now we're going to pair our phone to the Bluetooth. So bring up the dip and scroll down to the phone section. We want to make sure that Bluetooth is on, so press, scroll down to Bluetooth and press again. Here you can see that the Bluetooth is on. So exit using the return button, press once and scroll up to search for phones. At this point, make sure that your phone's discoverability is on. It's found my phone, it's paired to it, so I press, the Bluetooth is connecting to my phone. Enter the pin on the phone. Once you've entered the pin, the phone's connected and you can leave the menu. Press and hold the return button. Now that the phone's connected, we can use the steering wheel controls to scroll through the menu, answer calls and end calls. Before we start driving, we want to make sure that we're going to get the best from the truck. So we need to ensure that the eco coupling and the eco roll is switched on. Go into the dip and scroll down to settings. Scroll across to speed control and there you can see that both are at the moment switched off. To turn them on, press the button once. On is highlighted, press this and you can see that the downhill coupling is now engaged. Scroll down to Eco Roll, press on. Both are now engaged and you're ready to drive. Using the return button for a count of two, exit the menu. At the moment, we're displaying kilometers and I want to put it into miles. So I'm going to go into the dip and scroll down through to settings. Once in settings, I'm going to scroll down to units and I'm going to move down to distance. With this highlighted, I'm going to press the button again and select miles. Once this is done, use the back button, press and hold for two. Taking a look at the Driver Performance Assist or the DPA, bring up the main menu, scroll down to driving support and press the button once. Eco is highlighted, so press this button once. Eco Performance press again and there you can see your total of your efficient driving, anticipation, efficient braking and average fuel and we'll be using this system out on the road. To clear any previous score simply return back to Eco Performance and scroll down to Eco Settings, press the button once, scroll down to Reset Eco Driving, press the button Scrolling back to yes, economic driving is reset. Using the return button, go back to eco performance and there you can see that all the values have reset. Enabling the night mode reverse, bring up the main menu and scroll down to settings. Scroll down to dim settings and there you can see the night mode in reverse. This is highlighted press the button again and select on and we'll be looking at these features in more detail in our nighttime driving section.